In the last lesson, we started introducing some variables here within our PHP code. Now, in this lesson, I want to just briefly talk about case sensitivity within PHP code. And typically, when it comes to commands within PHP, the casing does not matter. In fact, if I want to show you here, like the word echo that I have on this statement here, I can actually make it say echo all capital letters. So I'll go ahead and change that for you. E C H O echo. And then here I'm going to go ahead and change it to a capital E. Here I'll just change it to a capital C. Here I'll change it to a capital H. And then here I'll change it to a capital O. And what we're going to find out if I save my page and refresh it, you're going to see that nothing changed here. Because casing on commands typically doesn't matter. If you want to do everything in capital letters, you can definitely do that. If you like all lowercase or if you like to uppercase one letter, then definitely do that. That doesn't make a difference on commands. I will tell you where it makes a huge difference. And the huge difference is on the names of variables. And so for instance here, you see ours has got an uppercase letter in the, in the beginning. And then down here, it's got a... So if I change the hours down here to being a lowercase h, I'm going to go ahead and save it now and then refresh my page and you're going to see that I've got a problem. And the problem is the fact that this doesn't recognize, or my code doesn't recognize what this H is. In fact, if you look here, notice undefined variable. And then they tell us to look at line 12. If I look at line 12, I can find it here. And so usually this is a pretty good indicator of where to start looking, usually within a line or two of this. And this particular error actually told me exactly what line it was on. A lot of times, if you see errors show up, it may be because you didn't have a semicolon at the end and so forth and so those will usually come up as errors for us as well on this particular one the error was the fact of having a small letter instead of a capital letter so make sure when you're typing in variables case sensitivity is extremely important we have to have the right casing because two different things um, with an upper or lower case mean completely two different things let me just show well, let me just show you as an example here I'll create a variable and call it hours and I'll set it equal to 80 and I'll go ahead and put the semicolon there so now I've actually got a variable here and I'll show you these are two completely different variables because of the names if I save it and refresh my page you'll see now that it went ahead and put 80 in for this particular one however when I did my math calculation down here at the bottom I used the capital H hours and it still used the 40 times the 20 and a half to come up with this rate so this video is working on case sensitivity of PHP code. In the next video, we're going to work on concatenating the strings within our code.